an O for Dark Falcon over uh, Peace. It's Dark Falcon, the uh, Richter player from Holy Knights, I think. Oh, and actually, Dark Falcon also 3 0 uh not Beast Mode, Elegym, Jackeron on that one, but either way, that is losers and this is winners. So here we go, folks. Let's get in to game number one going on this PS2 pick. Mr. E versus Luma. This is the apex of the tournament. The two competitors that have not lost once through this entire, like, what, how many entrants was this? 184 entrance brackets. These are the folks that have come up the strongest so far, and they are going to compete off see who is the best right now very even game with no one getting the biggest uh biggest lead as you can see the luma starting off nicely yep definitely have not lost a set but i can guarantee you that they've lost their sanity that's for one thing but right yep. now of course luma sitting at 55 percent gets that grab into the down throw nice up so converts it in the up air and that's wow. a stock immediately as wow. luma not wasting any time there to get that stock is gaming a chance. Mr. E getting caught by that laser, gets that Nair out of shield, trying to get something started. He's going to have to pull a little ways back here after that after that early stock taken from Luma as there comes that Dancing Blade and he pays it patiently to avoid the grab into the Dancing Blade. Gyro comes out and he trades that fair with a Nair as Luma sitting at 104% right now as Mr. E trying to work that percent back in order to make this even. Yes, that gyro tries to combo it, but he falls out of Nair. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, the oh. double down tilt avoids that, and he just responds with his own down tilt string there. Getting that gyro, it's more down tilt. The dash attack, laser 89%. Oh my god! And oh. it works out. He oh is god. dead. And Luma off to a very explosive start here in game one. Luma is looking so immaculate right now, dude. Look at this. The percent on Mr. Oh e, the top oh 50 into the side me. Okay, not quite. Mr. E, though, trying to go low with the consistency for the kill. The consistency that we see from Mr. E that we were gassing him up for so much is not working oh at all. God, Luma catching him. That was insane. Luma, what a statement oh, to start off game number one with the tree stock throw. Somebody stop this man. This is Mr. E, and you just did that to him? He just <laughs> he's utterly a, he's murdered He's a vengeance, bro. Oh, my oh, he's goodness. He's got a family, bro. You can't do that to him. <laughs> He, he, just, he just destroyed that man's family. That was and so he, crazy. Tyler, that, that entire first stock was, was a full-on zero to death. He didn't get touched yeah. once that entire time. He, yeah, well, that, I feel like maybe maybe that'll just give Mystery a chance to warm up. You know, I mean, it, sometimes that, that's yeah, always he's been waiting. He's been waiting a bit. He's been, yeah, he, he's been waiting yeah. a little bit. But well, that, that does tend to happen man. when you wait a bit as your momentum stops. But I mean, regardless, Luma, man. Just making Mr. E look like a scrub right there, just yeah. going to town, wailing on him. If he that hit that side B, I would have just, if he hit that side B, I would have just popped off. And they're not even wasting any time. They're yeah. going right back to it. Mr. E realizing, okay, I still, I still, I can make something work on this stage. I, you know, just got a little bit frazzled here and there, picked some, a little bit of some odd options, you know, normal get up into Rob back here. It's okay. I can do this. I believe in myself. Let's actually go to Smashville instead. Okay, Mr. E yeah. opting for the, uh, the smaller stage. Probably doesn't want to get juggled as well from the Rob. Uh, probably just wants those long, those short edge card strings to get that nice 48. Mr. E already starting out way better than he was. Going to go in with that Nair once again to get that nice percent. Already the 60, the consistency from Mr. E already looking way better than the previous game. He's made the adaptions and he has pulled off. I feel like he's definitely what's helped out is picking a lot smaller stages. Smash Ooh. Bill as he gets that fair, gets the stock. And yeah, the That's smaller good. stage might actually help out a lot here because that doesn't give Luma a chance to kind of just flow around. I mean, he can still get the gyros and lasers set up, but he's going to have a lot smaller space to do it. And that allows Mr. E to kind of just run in and play a lot more aggressively. As we see right now, as he gets the drag down in the up air, as Mr. E still with a huge lead here, trying to anticipate these air dodge. Nice back air, trying to go for that dolphin slash out of shield. Another dolphin slash out of shield. Man. Now, Luma's starting to play a lot more like. He's playing he's a lot more defensively, little... I think. Yeah. Yeah. Like, he's he's, he's playing working. a lot more to E space. Yeah, and that's what Mr. E wants, is he wants you to play at his base because yeah. that will allow him to just destroy you and just pick apart your weaknesses slowly but surely. Nice catch on that gyro with the bear, hitting him with the dolphin slash, and ooh, okay. nice down throw. Wait, we, 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 we got to talk about something real quick because Mr. E got three stocks game one. And right now, if you look at how this is going, it could be a reversal. It could like, be a reversal. It, it could be. Uh, 
Mr. E, do you want that? Do you want to get this game that bad, or do you want to die to up there? Well, he's not going to get it, because right. you're not surviving Rob up there. That, that, no, just... sir. No, 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 no. Difficult to DI that move, and especially at that percent, man. Luma, very good job finding that. Now, E just has to find his kill. Or is it going to be, uh, is it going to be Luma trying to even this percent yep. up, getting something? E just being smart, going to that ledge on that up. E now still looking for those up tilts. He constantly goes for them, and, you know, realizing that is his kill. Oh. That is his kill move, but in that case, it will be back air. E now up two to one, powerfully. Yep, and that pretty much just gives Mr. E control again. As right now, Luma oh. is, is doing a pretty good job keeping him off the stage at the moment, and he's still got a long way to go. That dancing blade is going to put in a lot of damage here. As Mr. E looking to just try and run away with this even more with the extra credit. Nice space on that fair. Gets caught. Oh, the dolphin slash misses, but Luma just not able to punish any of them. That gyro okay. actually helping him out. Throws it down. Oh, oh the gyro it. stops him. Nope, he's not. He's fine. That's right, still all living. Yep. Sends him yep. far away. Up smash not going to be enough to seal out that deal either. As you can see now, it's just going to be Luma continuing to space out his moves, trying to be careful, just not allowing the approach from Mr. E to take its position. Just consistently going for these moves back here, not quite going to land it. E now just going for something consistent, man. Always with the consistencies with the poke moves. Luma still just going ratchet, going crazy with those nares. Now, what's it going to be? How are you going to get off this ledge, if at all? Doesn't look like he's going to. E continually punishing these habits that we see from Luma time and time again, and he's made the adaptions, but you cannot adapt to red. Yes, you can. Yeah, you can. You, you can DI it properly. You can okay. DI the up air properly. That's that just gives Mr. Right. plenty of momentum. Nice Dolphin Slash taking him off. As now, that's going to put Luma in a tough spot to get back on stage. He's got a chance. He's using that back air and the upbeat. Oh, he parries the first hit, but he just dies because it. it's ultimate. You're not parrying anything before him. Yes, you you, you got to be careful about your shield, but it doesn't matter as Luma gets nared out. And Mr. E evening up the set here, making it 1-1. One, one. As opposed to what you see on screen, it's not actually 0-1, it is 1-1. One, one. <laughs> yeah, and just like that, Mr. E showing that he can make the adaptions, that he can understand your matchup and he can play it just fine. He show, he is, uh, he's playing pretty, uh, he played that stock really nicely. I mean, credit to Luma though, when, like, when he found his crazy openings, when he was able to get his damage, he made it pretty close, but you can only make it so close before Mr. E uh, consistently outranges those nares that you love to go for. Now it's going to be Luma's counter pick. Where do you think we're going, Rain Dance? Well, let's. My my heart wants. My my, my heart is pro, is saying PS2, because let's be real here. If that's this one stays that that, we, that we've seen constantly, it's going to be PS2. Like, I want to think that maybe there's a chance that they will finally, uh, you know, in, like be experimental. Okay, never okay. mind. They proved me wrong. Well, okay. actually, gonna, you're just gonna go to the other PS2 because you know the other we one went, it got we DSR'd. Went, so we, we went. Yeah. I forgot DSR was a thing. So we yeah. just went to we went to PS3. So that, that it's basically the same thing. It's just a little smaller, but regardless, still yeah. works for Luma. But I mean, right now it's working for yeah. Mr. E. As you can see, man, already Ooh. this seventy-four percent now eighty-eight, just consistently keeping him out, man. Just boxing him every which way. Although dedicating that up, he could get him punished, and it will. That's gonna only be the up tilt up there, though. As Luma now oh. actually getting just a little bit more. Okay, you saw him. He yeah. went for that charge up up the. But I uh, Mr. E. Light in his eyes. He was ready to see the Lord. Also, yeah. come back next update when we got PS4. It's gonna be fun, but regardless, oh, it's gonna happen. It's gonna oh happen. my oh. god, what a down nice. air from Luma. Taking nice the shot now. I feel like now that Mystery's kind of slowed the pace down, he's kind of playing it the way he wants. It's actually giving him a lot better chance to work around this. And he's down right now, but considering the stage we're on, it won't be long before he's able to bring it back. Avoid that nair. He's sitting with that gyro and the laser. Ooh, nice air dodge to avoid all that. Throws that gyro out. I'm hoping to catch him, and he gets that nair, but he falls out. Grab. I don't think up throw will kill at this point, no. so he's just gonna like for down throw for the damage, trying to get that up tilt, which would kill at this point. I don't know what traded there, but it happened. And the three still trying to get that nair. There's that up tilt. He's gonna get the shot. All right, and just like that, Mr. E, of course, going for the, those up tilts that we've seen him go for time and time again. It's just a consistent killer at those consistent percents that Mr. E likes to take you into. But now the question is, how is he going to be able to get this, this percent and this kill against Luma? Because as you can see, he's already done a good job of it, but still down by quite a decent amount. You never want to be down this much against Rob, because he can do so much to you, and he can punish you for getting that get-up attack. That's going to be the up here, but Mr. E, with the good DI, keeps him in it. Yep. Here we go, got that grab. He's got him off stage again at 62%. 
This is gonna give him a chance. Ooh. Nice downer! Oh, he didn't tech, but he has enough fuel to make it back. That could have been catastrophic if it was any other character, but he's able to make it back. It's caught the fair at 84% now. Mr. E, still close to dying, but he is spacing himself out to avoid getting caught, but it's not gonna be enough. Oh, wait, he doesn't go for the down throw. He goes, he looks for the back throw. Yeah, Maybe probably trying to trick him yeah. Yeah, gets that forward air, knocking him off stage again as well for now getting really close to death. Nice back Ooh. air, and he actually does steal the stock there. Taking yeah, probably uh, probably a little bit sus DI on Luma's part on that one. After all, Rob does look like the imposter, but still, man, oh, you, you got to give it up to E. His micro spacing in basically that entire interaction was insane. You saw him very, very carefully moving just outside of Rob's range and baiting the option. And as a result, yep. oh, that gyro actually, actually saved. Oh, Mr. E trying to lean in. Can you imagine? Gyro. Can you that imagine? I, if I would have saved him, I would have just that would that would have been the biggest brain play I've ever seen. But no, I mean regardless, Mr. E's still holding on to the lead. But you know he no, he, he, he has it. Stuff. He's got well. Don't say that yet. This is Rob, and he has a gyro. Oh, that counter might have been an accident. That's for sure. But somehow Luma not going too hard on the punishes here from what I would have normally expected as Mr. E able to take control again, gets that Nair one, gets the grab, yeah. doing some more huge damage yeah. at 100% now. And What's nice back air! Oh, I what is it? it. What is it going to be, E? How are you going to get this stock off against Luma, or is Luma going to claw back? I don't know, but right now Luma is making a good case for it to be him. But over dedicating on that side B will not get him anything. Now E going for these consistent punishes with the side B, and that wait, this could that be could big. have been really bad, nope. but no, only, only the dash attack. Only the dash attack. That's the dash attack. Not e? enough. He's Have going high. Careful. He doesn't have a choice. He's going to go high to try and avoid it. And he is just sitting pretty. Mr. E just keeping him in that shield now. Oh, no. Oh, Nair just for that shield pressure. The gyro, mm -hmm. he hits it, but he gets caught by that oh. down to knock him off stage. Oh, my God. Oh, okay, that's the Nair. Up. He's still nope, alive. 144%. He's got to be careful. One back there will be trick now. As that F tilt just pressuring his shield. Nice oh. Nair from Luma. He tries to pivot tilt. It's not going to work out. Another oh back God, there attempt. Nair, the laser, he's still alive. The up air, that's, that's it. it. That was Mr. E's game to lose, and he did. Luma pulls it back after being at 144 for several minutes, and it brings the game into his favor to go up two to one. Luma, are you real, bro? That was absolutely insane, man. Oh my God. Showing that when you get to that PS2 counter pick that he has, he can go absolutely insane on the stakes. He more than earned that game on that stock, bro. That was crazy. Oh my God. Just like that, yeah, Luma, up there, one game away yeah. from going to grand finals. Can you imagine? Can you imagine if Luma got the upset on Mr. E? I was saying it. I was saying earlier on that I thought that you know of the players that were left that could still upset mystery. I was saying okay, maybe Lazy Zack could because you know Sonic as a pacing character is probably pretty not that great for Lucina. But right now, Luma, he's making a damn good case for it to be him. That's the chance. Yeah, now with Lazy Zack out of the tournament, that gives Luma the best chance. And funny story, actually about this before I actually came in here, oh, I yeah. was in Mr. E's stream and he was talking about his least favorite matchups and Rob wasn't one of them. He didn't he didn't say anything about Rob, but he did say from what I saw, the characters that he likes to fight the least were Sonic, Min Min, and Robin, actually. So I was right. Yeah. Been well, right here we are on FD, a flat stage, this which makes sense. this is this does make sense, but at the same time, it's also one of Rob's best stages. I know a lot of Rob players absolutely adore playing on this stage. Mm -hmm. Because it just gives that uh, Well, I mean, I, it's definitely. I feel like, like I, I definitely agree, but I think it's a good pick from E still because he wants to catch those landings from Luma and what to ledge trap him. And not having yeah. those platforms really makes it easy for him to execute that game plan. As you can see, already getting a lot of these out of shield options. Now going to go for the landing, but can't punch that with the up. I think I think E has the right idea. It's just going to yeah. be about the execution of it. That's pretty much it. It definitely comes down to comfort more than anything, and I'm sure Mystery yeah. is very confident to play on this stage. You always just got to be wary though. Of the uh, of the at the same time the elements that your opponent can use to the stage and when it comes to FD Robs can shine on this if they're able to get their tools but right now oh. Mr E saying screw your tools I am just gonna kill you with a dolphin slash just taking that first stock here as he now has a pretty decent lead yeah we'll see no, this, what he can is, do with it this is very good especially against Rob on this stage in particular I'm not sure how high that platform is, the, the the upper ceiling is but on this stage it's probably a lot more difficult to get that the up throw kill or the up air kills and right now that's what we're seeing because he is not showing 
fear of it at all. Not. The back here. Well, Black that's got to do it. I mean, he had all the momentum riding, but he gets sniped once, and there you go. I mean, he's still got a lot of momentum, as you can see, but now Luma trying to start to get something started, man. Those little Rob nuances where he can just beat you out in those little frame hits could be a big, but Mr. E, of course, retaliating with his own ledge trap, going for something a little creative, but he does not get punished for it. Mr. E is playing this really, really carefully. Oh, they not quite going to do it. Now, here comes that Dancing Blade. Not going to be enough just yet. This is not Roy. 15% with the back air is going to do it. And Mr. E only one stock away from already evening up the set as Luma just sitting on the angel platform for a moment, maybe taking some time to assess what he's got to do here because Mr. Mr. E is now starting to box him out a lot as that entire uh, up tilt back air combo. Oh my god. 57. He is now running a train all over Luma in terms of percent. Just going crazy. Not yeah, letting man. the momentum stop. Ooh, reads the get up with the jab. 79%. Luma, what are you going to do to come back in this situation, man? How are you going to close this out to make it at least, or how are you going to close this out to try and get yourself in Grand Finals? You don't want to go Game 5 against Mr. Frickin' E, bro. Mr. E showing that he understands every which way how to play this matchup with the Nair out of shield, with the careful ledge trap that he's going to get here, jumping over Rob side B with the that back air, now going for this good. ledge trap only for it to be a bait so he can get another back air. That's going to do it, and Mr. E gets Game number 2 in a 2 spot or game number four in a two spot fashion. The FD counterpick worked out immaculately for him. He's showing that he understands this matchup and he understands just how to play it. Oh that boy. Was, that was fantastic spacing at the very end there too. That, crazy. that was that back air was perfectly spaced to avoid the side B and get the hit to pretty much put him in that disadvantaged state. And yeah. then he just once again was able to catch him doing something aggressive, which led to another back air. And Mr. E, you know, even despite the whole Rob counterpicking thing with FD, it worked out fantastic catching oh, yeah. all his landings. Definitely. Ledge trapped him perfectly and pretty much just pretty much took away any of the chances for Luma to play the game for the most part. And of see, course, look at that low back air that he hit, man. That was so good from Mr. E to recognize, okay, you've been going low a lot. I'm finally going to punish you for it. And then I'm going to scare you so you don't know how to recover. It was, it was just insane plays from an insane player, man. Mr. E is rocking this matchup well. Yeah. That's the, well, that's the power of conditioning, and with that, it has forced a Game 5 situation as we are going probably to Yoshi Story. Okay. okay. This is a pretty good stage for Rob as well, so we'll see as now he actually does have platforms again, and we've seen that he's done a lot better with multi-platform stages as we've seen on PS2 and Small Battlefield. So we'll see if this changes anything. Because this was this was what I, this was I think the stage that uh, that mystery was on in Game Five against Lazy Zach, right? Yes, yes it was, and this was uh, or it was Game Four and Five actually it was Mr. E's favorite counter pick to go to. He did drop one game on it, but the last one he did not. And as you can tell, I don't know. Luma's showing that he can make it work for him as well. Already having this nice percent lead with the, this platform, oh, nice getting that grab. grab into the up tilt, into the up air, and Dad. that's going to do it. Bad DI will result in the death of an E, bro. And just like that, Luma showing that he can still make this set his. Yep. He is doing really good. That that helped out a lot. This is definitely a really bad situation for Mr. E right now. Is giving platforms to Luma is just the scariest thing. Yeah. We've seen how much it's worked out in his favor. Here comes that F tilt as he is trying to find the stock to try and even it back up. Back for the shield breaker. I don't think that's what he meant to do there. That might have been an accident. As he gets the back air anyway on the roll read, even it up. And it is now a little bit of a deficit here, but Mr. E has shown he can easily make these comebacks. But here comes the grab. Avoid that down. That, 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 oh, oh my god! god. Luma with the mix up? That was really, really good. Luma, three, he's up two to one right now. Wait. This is possible. He's this two stocks to one. He is one is stock possible. away from going Luma? to Grand Finals. We'll see what he can do. Here comes that laser. The gyro just pressuring Mr. E. Gets him again with the gyro. Luma? He's up there. Oh my is god! This, is this your straight out of Smashville, Luma? Is this your tournament to absolutely pop off that and get that win that I know you are, have earned so for so long? Is this your time, Luma? Is this where you're going to excel? Because right now, Mr. E is trying to say it is not. Still fighting out of the corner, fighting so carefully, looking for all of these moves. Back here, not quite. Down smash, nope, not going to be it. Mr. E fighting still so hard. But Luma, is this your time? Serious danger right now. 132 done on to Luma, but regardless, nice down smash. Still not enough. 
Is this your time? Is this your time? Is this your time? The okay, dancing no, goes without the dancing, but the dolphin slash gets him. Oh, he's oh. out of fuel, but he's dead, but he still has a 97% lead. lead. It he's is not lead. done yet. Is this, your time? Is, this your time? is this your time? Is this your time? It is his time! Luma gets the up tilt to the up air and puts himself in grand final winner side over Mr. E. It is his tournament! Oh my god, the run! He has beaten Mr. E 3 2. How does and he do he it? Is now, he has earned his spot in grand finals. It's such that, a spectacular fashion. That was insane. Luma. Oh my god, it it's his time. It, it's his time, man. He found that up tilt into the up air on the landing from Mr. E and just realized that that was how he was going to get his win condition, man. Absolutely, just... He, he has more than earned this, man. It's his time. It is his time. Yeah. It, it, it's his time, man. Unbelievable. I could um, not believe... That, was, that just happened. I can't either, man. Luma got the upset on a top 50 player in the world, man. And Mr. E, honestly, from his playstyle, comparing this to like, I don't know, his most recent thing in like the Tri-States crew battle that happened at uh, LMBM, he's honestly not as nerfed as some of the other offline players. So you still outplayed him very, very nicely. Luma has more, just insane. It's, it's his tournament, man. It's his tournament. I just read someone in the chat so you take a shot every time Kuja asks if it's his time. Um, it is, oh, I'm, I'm dead at this uh, point, and I'm okay with that. Um, you see, I'm dead. You, you see, um, how do, okay. Because you know, it's I'll, his time. I'm, go, I'm going to make this as non-subtle as possible. Uh, this, what you just heard slam on my desk, is a 2.5 liters of water in my hand. A giant water jug. <laughs> it is literally, um, what the hell? or like 80 ounces worth of water so if you're asking me if you're gonna ask me to take a shot for every single time as to ice tea 